<laughs> morning everyone i hope you're keeping well i've just realized i've left my lamp on <laughs> hang on a minute don't know if it works better without it or not but there we go so today i've got i've been in them bags i couldn't help myself like i had hardly any clothes out and i thought right this is just not good i've got to live so i've got in them bags and i've had a bit of a grab i found some stuff and hopefully we can match it up with the grey pants of yesterday. So these are the new look pants. And I know you like them because you were telling us. So the new look and the kick flare. Kick flare is huge at the moment with like your new balance trainers. I don't have any, but I'm not bothered. I've got enough and I could put them with Oaks or with just normal like Nike 270s, which I love. They're the easiest for me to walk in. I don't know about you, but I find some trainers just horrible, horrible to walk in. So there we go. Oh, and I've got some socks for a measure, for good measure, just in case. Just in case. So what do you think? Shall we have a little play? And then obviously because there's pink here, if I go with pink, I'm going to have to do a pink makeup look. <laughs> so, ready? It's cold. I'm not matching. I'll tell you why. Looks matchy because I'm clever. <laughs> but I'm not matching. So let's go with these for sure. We need to pick a top. So I've got this one here. This is the Blakely one. Beautiful, comfy. The only thing I don't like about the Blakely sweaters is the Huggy Muffins, if you've got muffin tops, which I have. The Huggy Muffin tops, and if you get a bigger size, you end up with really big rugby player arms. And it's so that they can get the right on. So if you look at the back, see, so you get big arms. I'll show you. I'll put it on anyway and show you it. Then we've got this one here. This is current. These are current. This is still on the website if you want them. They're expensive, but they're worth it. I like the quality. Um, they don't really show big models, by the way. So this is this is why I show you. They don't show them on big models. It's all thin, young people. So that might it might not reflect how you're gonna look in them so hopefully you'll get an idea of me i'm five foot three 13 stone and a good size 16 18 uk now this is current it's asda george you can get this currently obviously i've just said current oh my god it's gonna be one of them mornings but it's, it's current it's very current did i tell you that this one is sheen yes and I love it. I'm thinking of going with this one actually now that I've got it out. I have wore it before, but not with the pants. But that's an idea. I might. I might. Well, I quite might. Yeah. So that one I think was going to have to go. I'm going to show you the Blakely in case you've not seen it. Should I put the pants on first? Yeah. I'll put the pants on first. So I'm going to get right back so you can't zoom in. Although I bet you are trying, aren't you? Looking for our things. <laughs> That's a joke, by the way. If you watched a previous video, you'll see what I mean. It's a funny thing. So these are New Look Kick Flares. These are Asda George. Yes, they're Asda George. The Entice. And this is the Vosey bra. Marks and Spencer's. I did get the set, but the bra, the knickers to this, just too tight. So I found these in Asda and I thought, oh, they look similar. I love them. Right. Come on then. Let's climb in. Did you have a good zoom? Can I trust you now, can I? There you go. So I do like the way these come up, they're comfy. You do get a bit of a, you know, but not massive. And if you've got the right jumper, it doesn't matter. And I'm probably not wearing the right knickers, but all mine's packed away, I couldn't find anything. And I've got to wear something. So, you've got, this would look good, wouldn't it? Very smart, but I don't really want to be smart, smart today. I want to be comfy, casual. So this, I'm going to put it on anyway and show you because this, loads of people love them, but I'm going to show you how they could look on you. Two. So this is a large. Just so you can see, got a bit of room. I've got mine tucked under. Bearing in mind I've stretched mine out a bit as well. They feel amazing. You can't take that away from them. The quality is, oh, 
just don't want to come out of them and they look really good from behind the front's plain there's not much going on with them so cross body bags are kind of good for giving something extra put a nice little makeup look on as well to bring it back to the front but i do like them but if you look can you see what i mean about the big rounded arms you don't get that on some of the other sweaters so just be aware, the bigger the size, the bigger you're going to have up here. Because I tried the extra large um, and I did, I felt too bulky up here. It was very bulky. Now I like, this is a bit of a tip for you. I don't know if it'll work for you. I don't know what you like. But they've got like just normal jumpers. I don't like them because I feel like they were really necky and then you have I've got this head and because I'm overweight at the moment and still getting used to it the new body the new husk <laughs> didn't like the feel of it all I felt very do you know what I mean so I think I like hoods because they take away from my neck don't know if you'll you'll see what I mean but this is the the design on the Blakely jumpers the bigger they are I think they look better in a hoodie format just so you know but there you go kind of felt the quality amazing send them back you've got to pay for it yourself it costs a lot of money to send back so make sure you get it right and that's why i'm showing you because like i said you'll not find big models modeling it yet i've asked them if i could they said thanks for your interest but it's not something they're looking into at the moment so just in future if you do look into these try and find i don't know there'll be loads of people wearing them on their um websites now and like in like tiktok and stuff try and look for like people wearing them because you'll not find them like a model and if you know what i mean so that's just to give you an idea of how that can look i don't want to take that off actually that's really comfy but we're going to go with this one this is the sheen one and it is really pretty look I do have a link i'm going to put one up for you i'll put it in the description or in the pinned comments <sighs> The only problem with this is I've got a code for you and I've got like a search, um, I guess with Sheen, the collaborations I do, they'll give like a search code. So you'll search my code and you'll get all my picks. But I think the discounts are for new app users only. So if you're already a Sheen user, which a lot of people are, you're not going to get the discounts. And I've asked them about this, if they could change it up. Same with Timu. Don't think it's something they're currently wanting to do right now. But you've got, anyway, £60 for 59 which is beautiful. Or you've got these ones. Don't know how much it was, but we're talking really, really affordable. And I like the way it hangs down. I think that's quite cute. I think I'm happy with this look. I picked a bag, which will go just perfect. I've probably put a jelly on. I've packed everything away. I would have used my light pink one, but I think I've packed it somewhere like under. <laughs> the good thing about this is you do have a bit of a baggy arm. This is the only problem with the the um the printed arms. The the like there's a lot of material. Still not as much as the Blakely one. I couldn't have gotten the Blakely one under this. This is getting tight on me now, but I can still wear it comfy. I can still put it on and I can zip it up. But I can feel it. I'm feeling restricted now. So any more weight and this is not going to be wearable either, like all my coats. So I need to sort that out when I move. I will. I've been living near a gym. I'll have no excuse. <laughs> not right. So this is the look I'm going for today. It's comfy. This, I thought, matty matty. Grey and pink. This you can't get any more though. I'm sorry. It's Radley. Actually, I don't think you can. I think it was like I got it five year ago maybe even more and i got it in manchester at the Trafford center and it was like a christmas it might have been a phoenix or a john lewis it was some big department store and they were selling it off for christmas and i just love pink and gray and i just thought it looked lovely so there we go there's the bag matchy matchy yeah this is this is pretty much my style I might change my knickers, I don't know, but I think I might keep them on. I haven't got much of a camel toe. In fact, actually, there's no camel toe there, I'm just being silly. These are a 16 kick flare. There's plenty of room in these for me. I'm a good size 16, 6 to 18 around the middle. 
um, and he's over 16 and they're comfy. I wouldn't have went for a 14, I would have been uncomfortable and poking all over the place. Um, could wear these for comfort? I think I might. I wore these yesterday. This, these would have been great with that grey and white woolly jumper from Asda for like smart. These are MOTF. It's a lovely little, um, it's like a, a sheen shop and style thing they've got on their website now. It's a different brand. There's another one. I think it's Anused. Really nice if you're in it like posh, beautiful clothes. They're very expensive on there, but you pay for what you get. Um, they're like a lot more than the normal sheen stuff. But you'll see if you go on there and have a look. So that's them. Um, I might just stick these on. I'm definitely not wearing the Uggs at the minute because I want to do some walking and they're not easy to walk in. Don't care what anyone tells you. They're really hard work. They hurt your shins, they hurt your calf. They're not good for your legs, your joints, your hips. Not all of them, but the the like the, the slipper ones, the jasmine slippers, the Tasman slippers, them ones. They're very hard to walk in, okay? Kind of wish I'd never got them. I might actually sell them. They're not for me. I know people don't care. They'll still wear them. They're comfy. They're dead popular. They're just not for me. I've got very flat feet as well, which I don't think helps because I've got no like arch. So I'm probably going to sell them. Give them let them, someone else enjoy them because I can't. Yeah, I'm just going to put these on. They're not really the best trainer for this look. If anything, they're actually quite grey and smelly. I'll put the backs in. People on YouTube can see. They're a little bit grey and smelly, but they're all I've got out. And I do want a smart trainer. Plus, they're creamy. I want something more like a white grey tone. And these are, they've got white and silver on. And they'll do for just getting around. But I could have done, like if you were wearing something like this, a pair of white and silver New Balance, and you've got a really good look. I think that's what people are wearing. But I'm not... I don't know, I'm not a fan of the New Balance. They just they just remind me of the old Nikes. It's not a style I've, I've, I've liked. It's not it's not one of them trends I want to jump on, you know? But there, there's what look. Take this off and let's get some makeup on, eh? Actually, you have to wait. I'm gonna drink water. I think I'll get this out first for you. Because I'm dressed, some people don't want the makeup look. I'm going to do one. Quickly get me perfume on. I'll say goodbye to you and I'm going to get the video film for makeup. But just so I can catch you on the morning before you get to work or whatever you're going to do. Perfume. It's got to be. Tom Ford, Lost Cherry. It's got to be. It smells lush. Ah. I think it smells like cherry bake well. I hope you're having a lovely day so far. I hope you have a lovely day continued. And I shall see you all later. Zoom, zoom.